The universal selector is used to match every element type in your document. It is represented by an asterisk. So this selector can be extremely useful for doing things like CSS resets. So if you want to remove the default margins and padding from all elements, you can use this. And this is also used to set the box sizing of all elements to border box. So now here is when the use of the universal selector becomes really useful. You can use the universal selector in a specific context. For example, if you use it with another selector like the element selector or class selector, you can create some really cool things. So let's target the grandchild of this container. So this will not target the child of the container, but it will target the grandchild of it. So it is a nice trick. So let's explain the selector again. Basically, you're saying to the browser, go and check every element with a class name of container. When you find it, go and look for any of its child. And I don't really care if it's a div or a header or a paragraph. I just don't care. So this asterisk means any element. Then look for a nested paragraph in these elements. Then add a color to it. If this is starting to be confusing, don't worry. Open up your text editor and have fun with this selector and with a little bit of practice, it will be easy to grasp.